What is happening, you guys? My name is Volts, and welcome to the demo of SCP Contamination. So this is actually a brand new SCP game that's coming out, and at the moment it's in demo form. I'm not entirely sure when the uh, full game is going to come out, and it's most likely going to be what's next in the video, but uh, yeah. At the moment, I only have the demo version of it, and believe it or not, this was actually made by one of my friends. I bet you weren't expecting me to say that, were you? Anyway, so yeah, we have the title screen here, which the music. Really good. Honestly, I like the music here. Now, I did actually have the honor of testing this out before it went fully public so I kind of know what the environment is like a little bit like at the very very beginning I didn't go too far into it but I know what it's like but I don't know how it sounds because I, n I didn't have my headphones on at the time but we're finally going to be going into the game so start okay you should be all set yeah I'm not so sure about this doc you aren't here to think only to do as you're told now listen. Okay. The time is now 9.42 a.m. And you are on site Delta-03, which we have now dubbed as SCP-087. Seven, great. Exploration of SCP-087 to try and establish if this, this? has an end point. The heck? It doesn't. Look, I'm aware you D-class personnel talk, but could we please focus on the task at hand? You are equipped with a 75 watt flashlight and are to descend downward toward the bottom of SCP-087 and report any findings as you go. Right. Or audio cues must be reported. Do you understand? Absolutely. Good. Now please continue down the hall until you reach the entrance. 087. I'll go with me. I think I've played 087 like a few times maybe. Not entirely sure. Now, I gotta say, there is a, a bit of like V syncing issues here, but obviously that will be cleared up in the full game, so I'm not gonna say anything about that. Also, I would just like to say that I've got my game on medium settings, as in like shadows, because if I actually wait, how do I how do I put up the settings? What the fuck? If I go into options and then put it onto high, yeah, that happens. So I've got it on medium because I don't want it to be too bright. I'm not entirely sure what the reason is behind the whole brightness, but it's a little too bright for my liking, so that's why I've got it on medium. And, and you know what? Medium is not a bad option. It's a, it's a nice option. But are we, are we able to zoom in? We can zoom in. Okay, good. Some nice zooming in action right there. And so far, like, it sounds pretty good, and, yeah, it looks pretty good as well. Wait, wait, we can go in here? I was not aware we could actually... Can we go? We, we can't go out, can we? I don't think we can. The fact that we could come in here, though. I was not aware that we could actually go into here, but okay. And, yeah, this is all locked off. I don't know whether that's a good thing or a bad thing, but it's a thing. So, all right. Do I just go in? Yes. Once inside, Dr. Kendrick will seal the door behind you, only opening it once we deem it necessary. Great. So what do I do if I get hurt? Try not to, then. <laughs> yep, okay, that's the challenge, everyone. Try not to get hurt. <laughs> all right. Oh, great. Okay. I'm starting my descent. Standing by for visual and audio confirmation. Wait, are they standing by or are we standing by for? I'm going to assume they're standing by and we can just, you know, go. i got to admit, I've not played OA7 in ages. There was like a I don't know, an enhanced version that I downloaded ages ago, just never played it, never had the time to play it, but, um, this is 
we're gonna go great. I wonder how many levels there are with this, because we're, all, we're all already at uh, level 7. And because this is in demo format, I really do wonder how many levels there will be. Um, I hear a girl crying. Doc, is there a kid in here? Please continue downward. <laughs> For crying out loud, yeah, that's exactly what my reaction would be as well. And their response was basically, there shouldn't be a kid in there. So, either this is just all in our mind for some reason, or someone's telepathically putting these sounds into my mind. Which, you know, is also possible. Imagine there's an actual kid down here, though. Imagine that. I mean, in a way, there possibly could or would be, because imagine a kid actually going into the staircase. They would be lost, and therefore crying. Okay, so you're crying and you're kicking about things, okay. And then the kicking just stopped. Very abruptly, in fact. Footy steppos. Here's the thing that I've never really liked about OA7. It's I think it's just like doing random noises to like well I think within the OA7 mythos it's just the deeper you go, the more uh your mind will make up these noises to like sort of skate. It's like your your brain is tricking you or the, the 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 environment around you is tricking your mind into thinking that these things are happening when they're not. But in gameplay format, it's just sort of random noises to sort of try and scare you. That's how I see OA7, and that's why I've not been a big fan of OA7. And yeah, the SCP, I'm like, sure, okay, but OA7, I don't think I've been a huge fan of. But only because God, of I don't know why, that. but I get the feeling this kid is either running from me or I'm just not getting any closer. What floor are you on, please? Uh, 32nd. Okay. Thank you. Please continue. I don't want to be here anymore. Something tells me that we're going to be encountering the kid quite soon, maybe? Why does it feel like the environment is a little different now? Maybe it's just me? I don't know. It legitimately feels like the, the environment is a bit more different now. Okay! Well, we've made it to 40 now. Still no sign of the kid, though. Come on, kid. Where are you? That's no longer a kid anymore. That sounds like a man. Yeah, definitely sounds like a man. I just realised everything's going all white. Well, we've made it to 50, everyone. Probably 50 more to go. Oh my god, I can barely even fucking see at this point. I can barely fucking see, oh my god. Oh my god. It's getting even more difficult to see, man, like, come on. I've got to be close to the end, right? really hard to see in here. That flashlight should be more than adequate to light the way. Can you still see the floor numbers? Just about. Okay. Please continue down towards the... Doc? Hello? Ah, shit. Oh, dear. 
So wait, is it meant to be going dark or not lighter? Is that is that what the uh <laughs> Because for me it's getting light. <laughs> if this is the intended effect, then you know what it's really really nice, but if it's not the intended effect, then fair enough. I think I heard that um other people may have got this bug as well, I don't know, but you know what? Who cares? Who fucking cares? Like, this ain't a, this ain't a bug. <laughs> but, I guess I can still sort of see where the heck I'm going. Like, I'm pro gamer, everyone. I'm fucking pro gamer. I can do this. And at least the crying is a little bit different. <laughs> it's so difficult to see, man. Dude, okay. I just wonder. I wonder, hmm, what if, uh, wait, I can't even, wait, what? I can't even see it. Wait, is that, really, really? So I had to have it on high. <laughs> I apologise everyone, I apologise. <laughs> okay, so, earlier on, it was fine to have it on medium. Hi! But now I understand I had to have it on high. I apologize. <laughs> anyway. So. Uh. Damn. Well, we're dead, I think. We are dead, right? Wait. Oh, yeah, I'm pretty sure that we're dead. Yeah, we're dead. We're dead. We're so dead. We're 100% dead. It's just our camera that lives on. Hi. Okay. Well, that has been the demo of SCP Contamination. That was actually pretty good, except from the whole like white stuff, which I just <laughs> I just can't believe that. And it's funny how I change it to high in the settings, and then I die by the monster. So me changing me changing it in the settings killed me. I can't believe that. But anyway, everybody, um, the uh, the next thing that you will see will be the full game. So I hope you enjoy my playthrough of the full game. Okay, so, you might be able to tell that there is nothing else that's happening on this timeline. Like, this is pretty much the end of the video. There's no full version later on. And this is mostly because the full version of the game is not out yet, and I believe it's probably going to be out sometime next year. I'm not entirely sure, but I initially wanted to put the demo with the full game. I have done that in the past before, but because the full game isn't out yet, I thought, okay, it's probably about time I should release this video finally. Now, because this video was actually recorded seven months ago uh, because I already mentioned earlier on in the video that me and the developer are friends well at this current point in time we are kind of not really on speaking terms I don't know if this is like a permanent thing or not I don't know but all I know is that me and them are not particularly speaking, so just thought I'd say that out there, and it does not matter if I am friends with the developer or not, like, that does not matter. What matters is that I am still looking forward to the full game, and I have always been looking forward to the full game, so, uh, yeah. Anyway, everyone, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you have all enjoyed this video. If you did enjoy it, please do leave a like, I guess, and I shall see you guys next time.
Peace out, everybody.